Hi everyone, it's Andrea from Lightly Sketched. We can't wait to share this paper globe craft with you. Today my daughter Chloe will be showing you how to create these stunning globes in just a few steps. Let's get started. For this paper globe craft you'll need a completed Zentangle paper globe template or blank Zentangle globe template printed on cardstock, scissors, a glue stick or double-sided tape, ribbon for hanging your paper globe if you'd like to display it that way, and a scoring tool. For our scoring tool, we used a Cricut scoring tool, but you can also use a pen without ink, a barbecue skewer, or an embossing tool. If you're starting with a blank paper globe template, you'll also need thin Sharpies or Micron pens for drawing your Zentangle designs. You can also use our Zentangle patterns as a starting point when creating the designs for your globe. I'll leave a link in the description box below to our three-part Easy Zentangle tutorial series. Step one, choose a paper globe template, add Zentangles and or color it in. Step two, score all of the half moon lines with a scoring tool. Each strip has four half moon shapes that will need to be scored. Step three, cut out the three strips of paper. Step four, fold all of the half moon shapes. And this is what the strips look like with all of the half moons scored and folded. Step five, add a piece of double-sided tape or glue to the end of two strips. Fold the strips into tubes. Step six, slide one of the tubes inside the other tube. Make sure that the scored half moon shapes are still visible. Step seven, insert the third strip through the other tubes from step six. Step eight, add double-sided tape or glue to the third strip. Tape the strip together to create the third and final tube. Step nine, double check to make sure that all of the half moon shapes are visible and not hidden under another tube. 
adjust the tubes accordingly to ensure that all of the half moons are visible. Step 10. Gently push all of the half moon shapes inwards and watch as your beautiful globe begins to take shape. And that's it, you've made a paper globe. <laughs> if you'd like to hang your paper globes, cut a piece of string or ribbon to your desired length. Leave the last two half moons unpressed. If you've already folded all of your half moons, simply unfold two of them so you can slide the ribbon through. After sliding the ribbon through, fold the last two half moons to secure the ribbon. Tie a knot at the end of your ribbon and hang to enjoy. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.